What is going on guys, Jack here and welcome your beautiful faces back to the channel but today's video is going to be something a little bit different but just before we get into today's video guys, if you could drop a like on this video that would be very much appreciated and if you've not already subscribed, hit the subscribe button and turn on post notifications so you never actually miss out on a future upload. Now today's video is going to be a little video about how to start a gaming YouTube channel. I'm going to go in through the equipment you use, what you need to use, consoles, computers keyboards, mouses, I'm gonna, I'm, just, I'm gonna do the cheapest way for you guys though, so hope you guys do enjoy and let's jump straight into it, so now basically what you want to be doing is go and find yourself an Xbox One X, an Xbox One, Playstation 4 Slim, Playstation 4 Pro, PS3, Xbox 360, do whatever you guys want to do, play what you want to play, it doesn't, you shouldn't really care what other people want to watch, you should just record and do what, uh, play what you want to play. And just post it out on YouTube. Don't, don't. If, you might get a few hate comments saying, "Oh, your videos are crap. You, you can't commentate this and other." But some people say that about me, so I'm not. I'm not really bothered to be honest. I just do it for the fun. I don't do it for money because I, I get like what 20 views a video, 20 views on a video. I'm not bothered about the money. I'm really not. I just do it because I love doing it. I love playing PlayStation. I love doing everything on computers, like editing, all that sort of stuff. But basically, yeah, go ahead and buy probably one of the cheapest options. It's probably the, one of the first Xbox Ones. Um, PlayStation 4 Slim. I've actually got the uh, PS4 Pro, so that's 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 something that's something that I wanted to buy just because of the Pro, because I'm going to get a 4K monitor very soon. And then I can play it in 4K. And obviously with Black Ops 4 coming out, I can record videos and obviously just playing 4k and just just feels a little bit better but for you guys go and buy the ps4 slim you can buy one now for like 220 pound brand new with a, with a game or an, another controller do whatever you guys want but that's for the console side of it i'm just gonna go out of the console side because that's that's a little bit of the boring part it was like, the, like it's a bit of the deer part that bit i'm gonna go on to the cheap part now basically as you know, I've got another dear part to be fair. But basically, if you've got a decent computer at home or a decent laptop, get that connected to the Elgato with your Xbox, PlayStation, whatever you play, PC, you can even play PC. But basically, get that all connected up, but make sure you've got enough RAM and gigabytes in the computer to actually run the Elgato because I did this mistake once. I actually bought a cheap laptop thinking, oh yeah, I can record videos this and other, and I put the Elgato system, like the software on, and it started lagging, I thought, oh, it must be my internet. So I upgraded oh, the internet, <laughs> wasted more money, it wasn't actually the internet, it was actually the laptop, it could not run the Elgato software very good, because there wasn't no gigabyte, had the gigabytes of RAM, the, um, there, were, there was hardly any gigabytes of RAM, there was hardly any gigabytes on the computer, and it was a new computer at this time, it was just like nothing on it whatsoever, it didn't even have um, a disc tray where you could put a disc in and like watch something or record something, it was horrible, absolutely horrible, I don't know what I was thinking, so I went out and bought a half decent computer, it's got 16 gigabytes of RAM, it's got one terabyte of storage space and I've actually got another terabyte hard drive as well. Because I do have a load of GFX on my computer and stuff like that, what I ha actually haven't deleted, which I do need to delete. But yeah, going into another part is a cheap keyboard and a cheap mouse for yourself and a cheap mouse mat. Basically, you can pick one up what actually lights up and changes colours off the way for like 10 pounds, which is actually really decent. I've actually got some Logitech speakers as well. They only cost me 15 pounds. Which was like, wow, because it's actually got a subwoofer and two small speakers, which is just amazing. You've even got a volume controller with a little rolling ball on it to turn the sound up and down. Or turn on the computer and turning the sound down on that. It's just amazing. And I've got LEDs on the back of my desk, so at night it shines up like all different colours, like flashing colours. Uh, it's just amazing. But basically what you want to get next is a capture card. Obviously you can get an Elgato capture card, you can get HD PBI, you can get whatever you want, but... One of the best ones is the HD um, HD 60, which is around 150 pound, I think. Um, that might be maybe 175 dollars or something like that, or euros. It could be 175 euros, something like that. 
but basically you're getting the best out of your money but if you want to go for a cheap one you get one second hand if you really wanted to and i've got the the standard first one what come out the elgato game capture hd is just a standard one it doesn't record in 60 frames per second but i am going to be buying the hd6 just because it does record in 1080p 60 frames per second as well as 720p 60 frames per second which is actually just fantastic it records one of the best like it just records gameplay so good and obviously running with the good computer and the, the good capture card the gameplay just come out absolutely amazing you'll you'll just honestly i'm not joking you if he was eating chocolate or some chips or something with gravy on as soon as you see the gameplay the gravy's rolling down your chin because your mouth is wide open it's unreal absolutely unreal but yeah basically we've gone through the capture card yes for all the xbox and whatnot we've gone through a decent sized computer with a decent RAM, uh, decent gigabytes as well. Maybe go and buy yourself a hard drive. This might actually work as well. If you've got like a crappy laptop, go and try, go and try get some more RAM put into the like the laptop, and basically that might be a cheaper option for you. I don't actually have a clue, because I've never actually done that. So we've gone through the, the computer, the speakers, and the cheap keyboard. I wish it, I've got the Razer keyboard and the Razer mouse. I think it cost me about 120 pound all in total, but. Basically, you can pick one head. of these up for like a ten pound. What I do like, so I'll try find one on eBay or Amazon. I'll link it down in the description so you guys can go ahead and buy one. I've got a Razer mouse mat as well, what I've had for over two years now, and it still lasted me. So I'm I'm not too I'm not too bothered about that. Uh, basically, you want two de decent monitors. What? Uh, showing 1080p, 720p. You don't really need 60 frames per second or 4K at the moment when you're just starting the YouTube channel. Um, but basically, you don't even need a console. You could just start a YouTube channel by doing tutorials and stuff like that. You don't really need a console. But it's best off having a console and a decent computer and stuff. And desk-wise, you don't even really need a desk. You just probably have a laptop at the side of you on the, on the bed or on a chair and just have one big screen. But basically, you might get a bit, a bit of input lag, but that's about it. It doesn't really matter. But anyway... Decent microphone. Now, I've got a, a blue snowball that I don't actually use anymore. I, I See, I tricked you there. I'm actually going to be doing a giveaway at 1,000 subscribers. So, when I actually do hit 1,000 subscribers, I will be giving away that snowball to whoever. I am going to say, I'm going to put a tweet out on Twitter. If you're not following me on Twitter already, link is in the description. And it's on screen right about now. And also, yeah, the blue snowball is at around 40, 30 pounds on eBay. Brand new Amazon. I'm just going to give mine away with the because I've got the Road Podcaster with the shock mount and the actual swinging arm. And it's, to be fair, it's one of the best microphones I've ever used. So, yeah, that's, that's what I've got anyway. I can actually, I'll put a pi picture on Twitter, so make sure you follow me on Twitter. I'll put a picture on Twitter tonight, just so you guys actually know the setup where I'm actually running and stuff. It's not the best, it's like, it, it's okay, but it is what it is. But anyway, yeah. If you don't want to be uh, editing your videos on uh, Windows Movie Maker, you actually want to be going and getting yourself Sony Vegas or iMovie or if you buy a Mac, MacBook Pro. But yeah, you don't want to be using Windows Movie Maker or anything like that. You want to be using Sony Vegas, but there is a free way to get Sony Vegas. I can link that down in the description for you guys if you really want me to. I, um, I can link you Adobe Photoshop. Um, is it 6? Six, six, success 6c something like that uh down in the description as well for free so you guys can get that but if you do need win right i will also link that down in the description as well but anyway guys that's about it for right now well if you really do want some gfx for starting out on a new youtube channel because that's basically what you're going to need i can do that for free for you guys I can do your thumbnails youtube overlays twitch overlays uh youtube logos youtube banners twitter headers twitter logos anything you guys want let me know i will do that for you straight away about that, just so you guys can start out on your youtube channel but thank you so much for watching guys it really does mean the world to me if you've not already subscribe like the video 